Hi guys, we are doing a quick tour of Lancaster Avenue, uh, house number 16866. Uh, I'm going to flip the walking up to the front door. This is going to be your front patio. Good amount of space here, really nice landscaping. Uh, I will do a full walk around the the property uh, after I get through the house so this will kind of be your first take of it we've got a beautiful cut out of um, oh my gosh why am I drawing a blank on the names that's oh, okay it's not important the house is important so uh, living room here or sitting area looking back at the front door and the steps going up um, I did a quick walkthrough of the house uh, before coming in with the camera and it looks like it's been uh, kept up very well We have dining room here with some built-ins And then walking forward we go into the kitchen Again, definitely uh, a little dated as far as you know what the most modern things are but what is here has been kept up with very well we have a pantry here with double doors and they're just still using it for some storage have a nice little eat-in kitchen window out into the backyard. Step down here into the den with a fireplace. Uh, I'll take a closer look when I get over there. I would assume with the age of the house that it is a wood burning fireplace. Thermostat there and then your laundry room. Laundry room, mud room, kind of, this is, uh, this door was the entrance to the garage, so you can kind of come in, put your keys, uh, coats, whatever, and then your laundry here, some extra storage, and then your water heater looks relatively new. I'm sure that that information is in the seller's disclosures, um, which I read through, but I was paying attention to uh, this out here specifically because I know that they said there was a leak um, when it rains very heavily in the skylight in the sunroom and uh, I wanted to take a look at that because it just did rain very heavily. Oh, this might be gas. Yeah, it looks like this is gas. Well, that's good. Oh yeah, I see the pilot there. Again, some built-ins on either side of the fireplace. And then down here into the sunroom, this is a, a pretty good size area. I want to say maybe 12 by 14. Again, I'm uh, don't quote me on that. It's uh, a, a educated guess. Uh, but if you're looking around the backyard, have a magnolia tree and some nice mature trees up here closer to the house. And looks like some holly. And again, really nice landscaping and a little brick patio. Uh, and then a sliding glass door that'll take you right back into the den. And you've got your fenced in backyard. So it feels, even though this isn't a neighborhood, it feels very, very private. You can kind of see the neighbor's yard. Um, Probably if you were out in the yard, you could see it better, but I feel like in the house, you feel really nice and um, secluded. And then I do wanna point out, so they, and this is in the disclosures, but there's, I don't know if you can see it, there's a little water there. Um, it was just raining uh, buckets <laughs> a couple hours ago. So I, um, I think that they said the really heavy weather is when there's a little bit of a leak um, in this skylight, so I just wanted to make sure that you saw that. 
And with that, I will cut this video off and I will take you upstairs.